Hey guys, and welcome to my humble quarters. Thanks for the great question, Maddie. Music in games and movies really helps drive home the experience for the gamer or movie goer, movie watcher, <laughs> movie person. And it sets the tone for what the audience should be expecting in the scene or level. And uh, just cues them to, for what they should be expecting in general, um, whether it's suspenseful and you know something's coming up, or it's just happy, quiet menu music, or it's just a full-fledged battle and it's really gritty and intense. But yeah, it just helps solidify the experience, and it's just such an incredibly powerful tool but uh, there is one thing uh, Caitlin you said that I don't quite agree with you were talking about how it the experience of a movie or game would not be the same without the music which I uh, I completely wholeheartedly agree with you went on to say that it would be you know, a, a quiet, dead experience without it, which is where I find out. Um, I was thinking about Interstellar, and in the first, I'd say, half hour of the movie, there's this beautiful shot of the spaceship coming up on Saturn, and it's just a tiny little flashing light that's just flashing in this huge, dark, dead, um, just scene. And the sun is way off in the distance, and it's just coming over behind Saturn, this huge, lifeless planet, and it's completely silent. And I don't think that you could find appropriate music for that. It just, the dead silence is, and there's not even sound effects. The complete silence is just, it helps create that idea that they are out there so far away from their home and they're just traveling into this complete, lifeless, unknown abyss. And the music just helps create that feeling of being alone and being just out there. But uh, you guys who are following up on this, uh, g give me your thoughts. Is there any... Is, is there... A, also a place for music not being quite relevant or being appropriate. Obviously it has such an incredible impact on movies and games. You know, it, as I was mentioning earlier, you know, if, if we were to see um, the sound of music when she was, you know, running out into the hills, if that was completely silent that would be quite funny and ridiculous and also there's this YouTube video of the iconic shower scene from Psycho with all the music cut out and only the corny sound effect of the knife just being jabbed into her and it's <laughs> quite hilarious I'd actually recommend checking that out um, but yeah it for iconic really intense moments like that or even in the more subtle moments, movie music and movies and games is just such an incredibly powerful, uh, beautiful thing. I really enjoy listening to, transcribing, and playing uh, music uh, from movies, especially those that have been composed by Hans Zimmer and James Horner. <coughs> so, uh, yeah, thanks for the great question, Maddie. And I'm looking forward to seeing what you guys have to say. See you later.